Welcome to another Mortgage Minute with Pat at 843750. That's the new VA loan limits for our area. We've been eagerly waiting. Should have had a drum roll going on there. Um, for 2013 uh, in the D.C. area. Okay, so below this video uh, is an attachment with all your county loan limits. What's cool about that is uh, that's an awesome loan amount. Uh, last year they were about 838. We were worried they may go down a little bit lower but they're staying up where they were. Uh, the neat thing is, and what your veterans do not know, is that this really helps veterans that currently have a VA loan on their, on their current house or, an, or a house in another state and that want to buy a new house. They, they don't know that they can use the loan multiple times or at the same time. So you can have two VA loans at the same time. Uh, if you have one, it does cut into your eligibility somewhat. So we have to do a calculation for our veterans to see how much they can borrow on the second go around. So, when the loan limits stay high, without getting into too much calculation stuff on this video, when the loan limits stay high like that, it, it enables more space and more eligibility for people to have two loans. So make sure your veterans know. If you are a veteran, uh, talk to me. We'll get you educated on how that works if you already have a current VA loan. If you don't, uh, you just need general information about your benefit, uh, just call or write the office anytime. Uh, for you uh, real estate brokers out there that are seeing this right now, um, friends of ours and, and, and others, we have the Veterans Financing class now approved for CE. It's two hours. Um, I'll be in touch with you if you think it will be valuable for your agents and your office uh, to get those hours uh, in office. Uh, we'll talk and, and set something up. So as usual, just call, give a call to the office, uh, anything we can do to help.